Shut. Gibbs, baby. Shut. I'm something. Shut. Yeah. Excuse me, miss, my name is Frederick, so check it, no disrespecting. For the record, I must say, can't do shit but picture you naked. Now picture you under covers, undressing, sucking, and sexing. Been over on balconies, you throw that ass, I'ma catch it. Stretch it, strip it, and stroke it. Hoping to keep you open. Dig like magic, straight hole magnet, I call it that hocus pocus. And hoes know this, I ain't no fucking hero. I'm fresh up out GI, right next to the shop where the niggas both pimp. Shouts out to B Low Zero. That shit y'all speak, kept a young nigga up on this grind. Now I don't trip on stupid bitches. Alright, what's up, everybody? Uh, y'all already know who it is, your boy Primo, the kind of sewer. You know what I'm saying? Whatever you want to call me. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm finally back. A lot of y'all been, you know what I'm saying, sending me little private messages and whatnot, you know, asking when I'm going to do an update. And I'm finally back on here today, man. And, uh, let's see what I'm going to talk about here. Okay, let's talk about uh, a lot of you folks know me from uh, Facebook. And y'all know that I recently... Um, attempted the five-day couch test. Okay, uh, I knew that days one and two were supposed to be extremely hard because it's all liquids, and it's all good, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I did that part. I got through that part with no problem. Now, where the problem came in is my birthday just passed. Now, all the stuff that I'm supposed to eat on this five-day pouch test, I've been doing it. I've been following the guidelines pretty good, as a matter of fact, until the night of my birthday. Um, and how I came off of it then, you know, I was, uh, I, I, I went to the, to the casino, and I basically, you know what I'm saying, spent a lot of time at the bar. <laughs> you understand? I spent a lot of time at the bar and and you know what I'm saying, I did some damage at the bar, you understand? So I kinda came off of that off of that diet a little because of that. Now, as far as the things I you know what I'm saying that I'm supposed to eat during this time, I've been doing all of that fine. That's not a problem. I just came off uh, a little bit with this liquor thing, you know what I'm saying, on the night of my birthday, you know what I'm saying. You know, hey, you only turned 37 once, man, so <laughs> I figured, you know, I'd take a night off and go back hard the next morning, man, so that's what I'm doing now, you know what I'm saying. Just, um, I guess that puts me on day four. Day four of the five-day pouch test because day three was my diet. I mean, was the uh, the night of my birthday, which was last night. You know what I'm saying? I was at the casino and basically spent a lot of time at the bar, like I said. So, yeah. Um, let me see. As far as the numbers go. Uh, you know what I'm saying, everything is going good, especially since I started that five-day pouch test. It's like I picked up a, I mean, I dropped off a quick six or seven pounds real quick, you know. But, uh, I mean, I think the last time I, I came to y'all, when I last weighed, I think I was 490 or 491. I'm thinking it was 491. And, uh... I weighed again last night before I went out, and my weight was 467. So that's what? It's like a total loss of 32 pounds, something like that. Yeah, about 32 pounds, something like that. I ain't did the math on it, but you know, uh, that's been about month and a half ago since I did my last video uh, up until now month and a half almost two months but you know 
Uh-huh. That's how much I'm down since then. And then, like I say, a quick six or seven of that, I, I picked that up after I did the five-day pouch test. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't know. I might... I might, instead of just continuing at this point, since I did mess up drinking the liquor and whatnot, I might just go ahead and start all the way back over. And, you know what I'm saying, everybody say the, the all liquid phase is hard and you can't, you know, once you really put your mind to it and say that, you know, this is what I'm going to do, you know what I'm saying, then that's what you're going to do, man. You know what I'm saying, Ain't nothing and nobody going to stop it once you put your mind to it. And it wasn't as hard for me, you know what I'm saying? Uh, like it, like a lot of people say it is, with all the headaches and whatnot. I didn't have none of those problems. Man. And what I was basically drinking was uh, protein shakes and water. Protein shakes and water for them for both of those days. As a matter of fact, because I didn't eat no high protein soups or nothing like that. So it was all protein shakes and water for me. Yeah, that's what did it. And you know, the first two days was all liquids. Then the third day, you start coming into soft proteins like cottage cheese. Um, 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 what's that? Cottage cheese, string cheese, and uh, you know stuff like that, mushrooms and you know little salt, salt proteins. You know what I mean? And uh, I got to the third day, and that and that was the night of my birthday. So that's when I came off of it with that little bit of you know. I told y'all before I got the. Uh, <laughs> I got this infectious desire for a uh, screwdriver. <laughs> so, I mean, you know, it is what it is. But, um, yeah, that's, that's what I might do. Though. I might just start all the way back over, and, you know what I mean, and, and just come back, just, you know, to bring it all back and just start it over again. I mean, it couldn't hurt in the weight loss area, neither, you know, so, you know, let's do it. I might start that tomorrow, you know what I'm saying? Hmm. Probably. Probably. Uh, yeah, but, uh, like I was saying, you know what I'm saying, your boy down, uh, what, 32 pounds? Uh, for this update, you know what I'm saying, it's pretty good, you know, weight steady dropping off, man, I just want to, you know what I'm saying, say real quick, man, to anybody that's out there, you know what I'm saying, and you watching this video and you thinking about having this surgery, man, I just want to say, man, this, this is the best move I ever made in my life, man best move I ever made in my life and I ain't never at no one particular time lost as much weight as I've lost now and I'd have been on all types of diets and programs and you know what I'm saying I, I'm, a, I'm a living testament to that, that weight loss surgery is working for me you know what I'm saying I ain't reached my goal or nothing like that yet but it's really working for me you know what I'm saying so if any of y'all out there thinking about doing this man save your life do it, man, because, like I say, it's making a hell of a difference in mine, alright, and I ain't gonna get all preachy and long with it and whatnot, so I'm gonna let it go right there, but I just wanted to say, you know what I'm saying, when you see somebody, you know what I'm saying, that's struggling with the same type of struggles that you have, it, you know what I'm saying, you wanna, and you find the answer, you know what I'm saying, you wanna do something, to get that answer to them, you know what I'm saying, let them know, man, you ain't got to be suffering like this, man, you ain't got to be, you know, as long as you put your mind to doing something, you can do it, man, as long as the help of this too, man, for real, and I know I'm doing it, I couldn't do it before, but I'm doing it now, you know what I'm saying, and I ain't got nothing to love for it, for real, alright, but I'm out of here, yo, and, um, I'll see y'all next month, my next update. Alright, one.